I've got a special word for you this week. It's found in Matthew's Gospel, chapter 16, verses 13, 14, 15. When Jesus came into the coast of Caesarea Philippi, he asked his disciples, saying, Whom do men say that I, the Son of Man, am? And they said, Some say thou art John the Baptist, others Elijah, and others Jeremiah, one of the prophets. And he said unto them, But who do you say that I am? Jesus did not want Peter living off the opinions of others. He wanted Peter to formulate his own conviction as to who was Jesus to him. That's what God wants for you. He wants you to understand that everybody out there, your family, your friends, people at work, people at school, they have a concept, you know, they have an idea or an idea or a value. But, you know, and it's good to learn from them. But God wants you to have a very personal, deep-rooted conviction of who is Jesus to you. Some people, Jesus is who they meet at church on Sunday. Some it's who they meet when they die and they go to heaven. Oh, there you are, I, I, I know you. Some it's the story, some it's very special services at resurrection time or Christmas time. But for others, it's very deep, it's very personal. It's their life, their life flow. The reason Jesus came into you wasn't just to meet you in heaven, wasn't just to meet you in a crisis. He came to live inside of you, to live in you every day of your life, and that you could hear Him and feel Him and experience Him. That's the kind of Jesus that He wants you to experience. So He doesn't want you just living here and off of that and off of this. He wants you to determine today, I want the Jesus of the New Testament. I want the Jesus that I read about. I want the Jesus that's with me every day of my life. Yes, to save me, and yes, to heal me, and yes, to deliver me, and yes, to be my peace, and yes, to, to meet me in the trouble spot. But all oh, way more than that, to be in me, to talk to me, to walk with me, to guide me, to assure me that everything that he has for me, I'm going to achieve, and you will achieve when you make him your life. What did he say in John 14, 6? I am the way, I am the truth, and I am the life. Let Jesus be your life today. That's your word for the week. Hmm.